Hello, hi, welcome to another Tom Ballard video blog or vlog. It's Tom Ballard. Um, very happy to welcome Melinda Buttle to the Thank proceedings. You. Thanks. Um, we I are... like how the light's on me and there's a line through my face. <laughs> We're on holiday. We're just taking a week out from the stress. Yep. From <laughs> just the busy lifestyle. Breakfast radio yep. and general unemployment. <laughs> we are flat out. We're flat out. You can um, tell from, from our appearance that it is early. And look, we've had a couple of wines, is we, what we've done. Well, we've had, we've had we've two. Had, we've had a couple of standard drinks. <laughs> two bottles. Nothing silly. Two bottles, two and a half bottles of wine. That's our third Tom's bottle. Had, Tom's had more that. than me on a lady. So. Do I have to pay excess baggage on these eyes? Do I have to pay <laughs> to get that on a virgin blue flight? Because I just had carry well, you're on. In the, you're in the Connors Club, you know, you should be okay. This is true, I'm a high roller. Sorry, um, what were you going to say? And then we watched The Human Centipede. Which is a film. Uh, it is a movie. Now, how did you feel going into the film? Because you've really watched a lot of scary movies no, in the time, have you? Never. Um, just, just so the the home viewers can relate. I like if an episode of Blue Healers got too scary, turn it off. Turn it off. If All Saints got a bit violent, ooh, no thanks. Back over the gold lotto. Watch a cartoon off to bed. So mm -hmm. I've never seen a scary movie ever, Tom. Sure. What was the question? What did I feel going into the film? Yeah. Very scared. Very worried. Yeah. A lot of tension that I just like held my. Body quite tight, which which might explain why I ache. I'm an emotional mess. Yeah. To begin with, like I don't yep. know if you remember today <laughs> when I we went into a fish and chip shop. We were served by a girl who was seven, <laughs> which was so lovely and she was so wonderful. And she was having the time of her life, and then yeah. two minutes later, I'm upset. Yeah. Because she lives in a small town in northern New South Wales, and sure, sure. will just grow up into a so horrible. So the person. idea of horrible. strangers being abducted and having to have their mouths grafted onto the anuses of other human beings. I mean, that's... ding a ling a ling ding a ling a ling That's, you know, it's pretty disturbing for you. I'll make a list of things I don't like in cinema. Mm-hmm. Blood. Cool. Violence. Yep. Scary music. Mm-hmm. Uh, anything that's not funny. Yeah. So I, I found, I found a lot of problems with the film. Mm. What are your thoughts on the film? Let's give it a... Margaret and David. I thought it was fantastic. Earrings. Earrings. <laughs> oh, I loved it. I give oh, it two I didn't out like of the, five. Oh, I like the handy oh. ca the handy camera work. Oh, David, what would Fuck you know? Fuck off, David. You're too old. Margaret, I think you're fabulous. Margaret's great. I David, you're too old and grumpy. I haven't done you justice, Margaret. Close-minded. Is Margaret a different person to Maggie Beer? I guess one. Is, does Maggie Beer just get earrings <laughs> <laughs> and then go on the set of? Ooh. Mm, Ooh. Mm. Oh, I've got to, got to head off from the Barossa Valley. Yeah, put this quince paste down. <laughs> Watch a movie. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, David, no, no. no. David, you're I old. loved it. I loved it. Oh. Quince paste. <laughs> quince paste. <laughs> like Superman. <laughs> Hearing on. Hearing on. There you go. So that's. That's. I don't know where I should be. Oh, I think I should be here. That's another Tom Ballard uh, video blog.